Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Where are we going next? Today we're continuing our resort tour series again around Bahia Principe Riviera Maya. This time we're at Bahia Principe Luxury Akumal and we're here in one of the adults only rooms. And uh, this is gonna be a contrast to the other room that we toured here at the Luxury Akumal. This room's gonna be a little bit more upgraded. Um, and then there's still another upgraded version of this with a ocean front. So we don't have an ocean front balcony, but we will show you the view from that in uh, just a few minutes. So yeah, so this arrangement is a king size bed. You could get two double beds and you have the option of converting the sofa into another bed. Just before we get started, I'm gonna give Bahia Principe a big thank you for hosting us on our stay and providing us with access to these rooms so we could show you guys all the different rooms and buffets here at the hotels. So we're gonna start the tour um, at the front entrance like we normally do. I wanna point out too that there's a really cool little um, feature here where you can open up the bathroom so you can see all the way through the room. So I'll show you that what that looks like in the bathroom in just a minute. So as we start to tour from the front entrance here, as you come in the front door, there is the closets just off to the right side here or on the left if you're coming from the door. And inside we have all the different storage you can use to hang your clothing and uh, put your suitcases and stuff. We have an ironing board and iron, umbrella and some hangers for your clothing. And also Bahia Principe does provide luxury guests with robes and slippers as well. So anybody staying at Luxury Akumal or Luxury Shan Khan will have robes and slippers. In the next closet here, we've got uh, some additional storage just on the bottom and all the way up here. And then we have an in-room safe here to uh, secure your valuables during your stay. And then from the closet area, this is gonna be the entrance into the washroom area. And this is a big difference between the uh, adults only rooms and the regular rooms that you'll find in the villas throughout the resort here. So a big difference here, and you can compare it to our other uh, room tour video, Luxury Akumal. Instead of a single sink, we have a double sink. We have uh, the toiletries offered by the hotel here. And a big change here is that the toilet is in its separate private little room here. And we have a stand-up shower with this big glass door. It's a rainfall shower. And then if we turn over this way, there's a separate soaker tub here as well. And that has jacuzzi jets. As I said before, there is the window here. I did open up the curtain so you could see through out to all the way to the outside here or just in the room. And of course you can close those shutters as well for some privacy too. If we turn over this way, we're gonna head into the bedroom area. And if you saw our other video, you'll see that things are a little bit different in this room too. The bed's got these posts with these curtains here just for a nice little luxurious touch. The lighting uh, sconces here are a bit more of a kind of like upgraded luxurious design. But if we look over here to the left, we've got our traditional luggage table here and uh, some storage underneath. And then here in the mini bar, um, similar to the other room we toured, and um, all the other hotels have this as well. They have coffee makers, coffee, tea, and fixings for your coffee. And then also um, water is provided by the hotel. But the luxury guests are gonna get the ice bucket and then a couple other features here too, which I'll show you in just a second. So all guests are gonna get the mini bar. However, in the mini bar here at Akumal, you can have these items restocked as many times as you want through the day. Whereas at the grand hotels, you'll only have what's offered here and that can be replenished once per day only. Or if you want some more for additional charge. So we have uh, Steve Aoki Dos Equis. We've got some Coca-Cola products, soda water and uh, still water. And then luxury guests also have some potato chips added in their room as well. One other thing I actually forgot to mention that luxury guests can also enjoy in the washroom here. It's nice that there's a window that I can show you the washroom from here. But um, you can get aromatherapy for the shower or bath and that can be requested through uh, guest services. You can also get an aromatherapy, an aromatherapy machine for your room um, and that's also requested through guest services too. So those are cool extra luxurious perks you get for staying at the luxury hotels here. There's also a pillow menu you can request as a luxury guest and uh, that's done through guest services and you can request any type of pillow or additional pillows if you, requ if you require them. Just beside the beds, there's two bedside tables, one here and one on the other side. And again, the phone to reach out to anybody you need to during your stay. And also, uh, in addition to some of the other things we mentioned, you can request room service. Just to mention too, we do have um, some power here beside the bed for your devices. And then on the other side of the bed, 
we also have power and then the switches for the lighting in the room and also the, the switch for the ceiling fan which is just up here and it is pretty windy in the room right now with that ceiling fan but there are speed adjustments there you can use to uh, put the fan to the speed for your preference. So yeah, so just across from the bed you can see there's the TV here and uh, just beside the TV there is the menu for in-room dining. So I'll let you scan the barcode and take a peek. And then to top off the, um, the area over here, we've got some extra drawers here for additional storage. Also in these adults only rooms, there's uh, a little table here with a chair. Uh, we've got an extra lamp here just to add some more lighting to the room. And we've got two chairs and a table to hang out at or maybe have some in-room dining. And then the uh, sofa bed here, which is a little bit bigger than the other rooms here on resort. So adults only rooms have a little bit extra stuff to them, just saying. And then we have some nice artwork on the, on the wall here to kind of pull all the colors together in the room. So lastly, what we're going to do is we're going to head outside here to take a look at the view from the balcony. So if we come out here and look over to the right side, we actually have a view of the ocean just there. I know it, it's just a little bit of a sliver here, but you do have a little bit of ocean view from this balcony, which is really nice. Um, you can see just over here, this is the uh, adults only infinity pool and just driving away right Driving away right now is the trolleys that can take you around the resort to different pool areas or to the main lobby. And then on the balcony itself, we've got these nice upgraded wicker chairs to sit at and a small table with an ashtray. So it is nice, this pool over here is adults only, so if that's your preference, um, you can hang out at that pool there. And there is service with bar and there's a little snack bar just there as well. And a little lagoon too that you can swim in in the ocean there. So if you wanted to see some more of that, we did a full tour of Aku Mall as well, and that's up on our YouTube channel, so you can take a look at that video to get a bit of a lay of the land and what's offered here at this hotel. So with that, that's gonna do it then for this video. I hope you guys found this helpful in maybe choosing a room here at Aku Mall or deciding if Aku Mall is the right hotel for you. If you have any other questions, please feel free to put them down in the comment section below. And uh, if you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel to find out where we're going next.